Hello everybody, my name is BJ Simpson with the National Weather Service in Amarillo and I'm going to run you guys through a quick update on what we're thinking for severe weather today, tomorrow, and Saturday. As you probably know, we've got severe weather possible all three days. The primary hazards are going to be hail and damaging winds, though isolated tornadoes cannot be ruled out and heavy rainfall resulting in flooding and flash flooding will also be a possibility. Overall, not much has changed since yesterday as far as our thinking on the severe weather threats. We've got a slight risk this afternoon. The better chances are going to stay down there toward Wichita Falls and, and in southwestern Oklahoma around Lawton areas uh, with the ongoing thunderstorms that are moving that direction right now about noontime here on Thursday. Uh, but we do have a very slight chance to see some redevelopment up here, especially in probably the northern Texas Panhandle, Oklahoma Panhandle this afternoon. And if we do get redevelopment, severe storms will certainly be possible. There just probably won't be very many of them or maybe none at all. Tomorrow, the dry line will sharpen up a little bit and move east about halfway through the panhandle, so the better chances are going to be from basically Amarillo to Guyman eastward tomorrow, and then even better chances as you go uh, southeast of the panhand Texas panhandle. And then Saturday is looking like a severe weather outbreak day. Fortunately, uh, the, the worst part will probably stay just east of our area, but we could definitely see the eastern two tiers of counties in the Texas and Oklahoma. Texas Panhandle along with maybe Beaver County and maybe Texas County and the Oklahoma Panhandle uh, be the places where the storms do initiate Saturday afternoon before they move off quickly uh, to the northeast and um, that would probably be our best chance for tornadoes through this period if we do end up getting any would be in our northeast parts of our area on Saturday afternoon with those storms developing. So as we drop back again today, you can see uh, the tornado threat is 2% according to the SBC outlook today, and wind and hail are 15%. These are generally um, kind of the minimums for the slight risk today. Uh, we'll say that if we do get anything, though, if we do have one supercell develop, uh, all types of hazards will be possible with that. It's just a matter of whether or not that will actually happen. Confidence is kind of low. Uh, just very briefly here, the dry line set up this afternoon. The whole area is in the warm sector here uh, with the dry line going to set up basically along the New Mexico-Texas state line. However, we don't have a whole lot of other forcing to kick off thunderstorms, so that's why we think it's going to be quite isolated here this afternoon. And here is that area. We do have thunderstorms currently ongoing here midday in the southeast Texas panhandle, uh, but just a 20% chance for everyone else this afternoon. And that's all we've got for you. Thank you for listening.